Being a special resource built by veterans in the valley, and tonight we're seeing the tattered remains of a specially designed ambulance. The wrap ripped and cut sometime during the night. ABC 15's Megan Thompson walks us through the damage and the plans on how to fix the mess. Burn the, the top of the hood. He thinks they took a blow torch to military seals. The Navy portion, the Coast Guard portion. Trinity Courier is the owner of Emergency Medical Veterans Response. He says he woke up this morning to something he couldn't understand. I didn't know the extent of the damage until it actually, until actually I got to ASU for the 9-11 uh, tribute run. Um, where I actually had a chance to take a look at it in the light and see how much damage was, was actually done to it. The company provides medical aid. We do youth football games, we do high school JV games, we do high school varsity games. Um, we do some of the local concert venues around here. As well as works with the U.S. military on special projects. The wrap has only been done for about seven months. And so soon it has to be completely redone. The damage passed patching up. A, a wrap, wraps aren't, aren't really cheap, you know. They're about $4,500, $4,800 for this one in particular. Um, it's completely ruined. Courier has started a GoFundMe page because replacing it isn't in the budget right now. If you'd like to help, just go to our website, abc15.com. Megan Thompson, ABC 15 News.